Did you feel like you were in the pit or something there? What, <laughs> what, what happened? Yeah, uh, it felt good. They were uh, dialing some things up for me to uh, give, uh, give me a chance to make a play, and uh, thankfully I was able to do so. But yeah, it was just kind of kind of like high school again. It felt good running around out there. Walk us through the first two drives there with Brendan. Obviously, you catch a 60-yard touchdown, then you come back with the big gain and then another touchdown. Walk us through what you saw on those yeah. two drives um, there. So the the first touchdown, the long one, uh, I'm really kind of the last read on that play. I'm setting the depth mesh for, I think it was Aaron or Tyron running. I'm kind of setting the pick for him. But the whole defense ran with him and led me wide open, so I was able to take a long one. Then, um, yeah, the, the deep pass coming back this way. Uh, Brennan gave me a chance one on one and was able to win that matchup. Then uh, that next touchdown um, got a nice play where I kind of spake cell block and I kind of leak out late. So, um, you know, props to Brennan and Coach Sat for kind of calling up those plays and I'm glad they worked. Which one felt the best? Uh, probably, probably the long catch, the one that wasn't a touchdown after my long one. Um, you know, I. I just caught it, I was wide open, so I just kind of ran, but that one, I felt like it was a good play. Um, I was able to win a 50-50 ball, and uh, that's kind of what I got to After the last season. one, you gave him the one, two, three, four. Is that uh, <laughs> something we can expect, uh, a little showmanship? Uh, no, I mean, it's just a scrimmage, so I'm just trying to have some little bit more fun out there. Um, obviously, I'll be a little bit more smarter in the game. Um, you know, I dunked on the goalpost after the first one. The refs come up to me, and they're like, hey, you can't do that. I was like, dude, I know. It's a scrimmage. <laughs> I'm just trying to have a little fun out here. Um, but, no, I'm, I'm, not, I'm not really too much of an emotional guy out there, but, you know, I was just trying to have a little bit of fun today. Do you feel like your deep threat ability can be a consistent thing that Coach Sack can attack with this season? Uh. I hope so. I just got to come out every day and keep uh, proving to them that I'm able to kind of be that guy and win those matchups when uh, the play gets called. But uh, I hope so, yeah. Got to feel good in that setting here at Nippert. Uh, you probably got some friends and family in the, yeah. in the stands here today to, to have a day like that. Yeah, it was uh, – my dad was here and aunt and uncle and I had some people here, so it was uh, kind of good to play in front of them and uh, then to be able to see what I was able to do today. <laughs> <laughs> you, got, you got a lot of people to add before you have like a, like a Josh Wiley level. <laughs> Did he have a big one? I, they're like half the crowd had 81. <laughs> <laughs> the whole West Side. Yeah, was here. yeah. I'm sure as the season comes, there'll be more. Hopefully, there'll be a good amount of 11 jerseys out there. But are they going to be Gold Day jerseys or Royers? <laughs> I'm fine either way. Jake Gold is a hell of a player. Um, super glad we have him, but either way, I'm good. <laughs> How good it feel to get back here at Nippert Stadium after a grotling week at Higher Ground? Uh, it was good. Um, you know, I mean, Higher Grounds. I'm really, I'm doing okay with it. It's, it's as good as you make it. It's as bad as you make it. So if you go in there with like a good mindset, um, you'll do fine out there. And it's, it's really hasn't been too bad. Kind of enjoyed it, and it's been good for me and kind of my camp getting away from everything and trying not to get on my phone as much as well when I'm out there. So uh, it's been good. I'm really just trying to kind of be the best football player I can be right now. Looking forward to your own bed tonight. Yeah, yeah. I'm, as soon as I shower and go get food with my dad, I'll probably be in there until we leave tomorrow to go back to higher ground. <laughs> yeah. Coach Sat talked about how you haven't had a ton of time to play a lot of football in college, and now you're kind of getting that opportunity. Yeah. Do you feel like you're seizing the moment right now? Yeah. Um, you know, that was a big thing. I dealt with kind of some injury and uh, family issues when I was up in Columbus. Um, but yeah, just coming back here, the main thing for me is just staying healthy and being consistent, coming out every day and uh, Coach Step, And uh, he's given me a lot of plays this camp to kind of harden my body and get me ready for the grind of a season in a game. Because, you know, out there, anywhere like 40, 50 snaps, and I got to be able to withstand that. So um, just coming out every day, doing as many plays as I can, um, just trying to get ready for the season. But yeah, I'm, uh, I'm super excited to hopefully play a lot of uh, ball for the Bearcats this season. Red zone was a struggle for this offense last year. How much of a focus has that been being a little bit more yeah, uh, out there? I feel like we've been doing something red zone kind of oriented every day at practice. And, um, you know, I, uh, when I came in here, I heard that was kind of a big issue. Like I heard, uh, and I was looking at some stats. A lot of times uh, they were outgaining opponents, um, but they just had issues when they kind of got down to the goal line. So, uh, yeah, it's been a really big focus uh, for the whole team and, um, you know, trying to scheme up different things for different matchups. But uh, I think we'll be, uh, I think we'll be great this season. Such a good day today. Are you gonna keep the facial hair? Is it no, no, no. <laughs> this little like Fu Manchu thing. It's just. 
like I said, there's not much to do up at a higher ground, so people are just doing <laughs> weird goatees and stuff. Uh, nah, it's coming off uh, probably when I get back to my apartment because I think we got pictures sometime the next week, and I can't have this on there. Uh, <laughs> everybody up there cut their hair. Nah, I can't. Do that. No, I'd be I, ashamed to. Do I would go. I would do. I'd do something to mine. I would cut it though. <laughs> Thanks, Joe. Yeah, Thanks, Joe.